Well, I was working on a towboat on the Mississippi River near Cape Girada in Missouri, and my wife and I just got married. And about three days after we got married, they called me back on that boat. And uh, I rode the boat for 30 days, and then we'd get off 15. When I got my 15 days off, I said, I'm gonna look for me a better job. <laughs> Sure enough, I found one, Hod Carrier, which is now our mason tenders, $2 an hour. And I stuck with that till, till I became apprentice bricklayer. Okay, I served uh, three years as an apprentice and became a journeyman bricklayer. And I worked in Southern Illinois, Southeast Missouri, and traveled some. And in about 1973, this old contractor I was working for gave me an old wore out mixer. So I drug it in on the carport, put a new shaft in it, made paddle blades out of car tires, and I commenced contracting, doing houses. And about 75, I uh, bought me a forklift. And uh, from then on, we went on and we have a couple cranes now and everything's going well. Yes, the, the biggest challenge we ran into was we belonged to the union and the operating engineers claimed running of the forklifts. So with some help from other contractors we had to take them to court and got help from MCAA and were able to go back with the uh, mason tenders on the lifts. Oh, the proudest was uh, way back in 94, my son won the fastest trial on the block and uh, won a new truck. And they turned around and won it again in 1996. And then my grandsons have won uh, the uh, Spec Mix 500 uh, locally and are now going to proceed in it tomorrow here at, in Vegas. Uh, don't get too big too fast and uh, a cheater never wins and a winner never cheats. People not coming to work on time, not interested in how their work looks, and that's about it. Just lack of training also. Well, it's a good, it's a good industry. It's a, don't work, just come to work on time and work steady. Oh, it's the greatest thing I've ever got. I just, just can't hardly believe it. It's, uh, <laughs> I don't know, it's just, just unbelievable. I feel like I've uh, made my goal. Worked for 50 years and I got her. Well, I guess uh, winning those uh, labors to run the forklifts taking them to court and we had gun battles and destruction of our equipment and that's all behind us. We won. Well, I keep everybody working pretty hard in festive masonry. We have a couple sayings or mottos we go by and if one of them is if, you, if you're not spreading your mortar by seven, I'm gonna send you home by 11. And the other one is you can lay them fast, you can lay them slow, but if you don't lay them to the line, you gotta go.